once you can tell where someone's aiming, all you have to do is get out of the way. I moved into her blind spots and ran on the walls so she wouldn't see me coming. What? You ran on... What is going on? Come on, like... Today we will go to... Who is that? There you are. I've been waiting. I've been waiting. Waiting for what? Yes. Why? I knew you would come. It's a pleasure to meet you. My name is Kokoro Surugadai. I'm a first-year high school student. And... the Pact Bearer of Sloth. Don't worry. You will be safe and secure with me. I am not your enemy. Not now. And not ever. I don't intend to use my authority within the Academy either. I understand that the authorities in the Mist are directly correlated. When? I have only one wish. What? To hurt no one, and to be hurt by no one. Oh, really? As such, I would like this Academy to remain both safe and secure. Me too. In order to achieve this, I would like to defeat the Pact Bearer in the First Year Building. The Pact Bearer of Wrath, to be specific. Something must be done about him. I would appreciate if you could help me. Nah, bro. I'm good. My power is called Precog Analysis. It allows me to see what path leads to the future I desire. That is how I know I will need your power in order to defeat him. So... Thank you. Act 1! Kogoro Surugadai! Retribution from beyond. Yeah. You have my gratitude. Oh, and incidentally, all I know is that you are a key player in resolving this incident. As far I as defeating the am. pact bearers go, my understanding is rather limited. Uh -huh. As such, I will require you to tell me everything you know. A mutual of exchange course. of information. I see. I was not even aware of these ideals you speak of. This has been very insightful. 
The first year building is shrouded in mist as well. I speculate that shattering these ideals and dispelling the mist will allow us to defeat the Pact Bearer of Wrath. Uh -huh. Let us go to the first year building. Toot sweet. The Pact Bearer of Wrath is extremely dangerous. I'd prefer if we subdued him as soon as possible. Why is that? Why is that? Where? Yeah. The mist that surrounds this place belongs to me. I cannot allow anyone else to be here. The mist that surrounds this place belongs to me. I cannot allow anyone else to be here. Where are we going then? We should be able to enter now. Can I... Can I upgrade you? I was the one who locked it. No. For safety, of course. Oh. Of course. They are not allowed to leave. He refuses to let them. Who? Oh. I locked the door so the first years who are not already in the building won't wander in and be trapped as well. There have been enough casualties already. I am certain your presence won't bother him. You are, after all, a second year student. How about you? I will be fine. The rules nah. do not apply to me.
He killed the students who tried escaping the building to make an example of them. It is, in a word, irrational. There is something I want to tell you before we begin. This may be unsettling to hear. But an inescapable destiny lies before us. to make a break for it no that's not it i'm getting a chill a chill i i wow. hand power here's power let me take a guess you didn't want to kill him. Oh, what a wonderful friendship. How he pisses me off. So glad you decided to return. Oh, and Chip. I made up a new rule for the building. Anyone who hurts you dies on the spot. I am the only first year who can come and go as she pleases. Those assholes treated me like shit for no reason. They had it coming. Huh? Kokoro was the only one who treated me like an equal from the start. That makes her the only exception. The only exception. I don't know who you are, but you can take it easy. It's not like you have anything to do with this. Kokoro, uh. I just have two more to get rid of before my revenge is complete. Once I'm done, my curse will be lifted. <sighs> when that time comes, I have something I want to tell you. So wait for me, okay? Yeah. I knew it. Damn it. Damn you, Subaru! Hirei Fumi, are you all right? No. Does he look okay to you? Who even are you, anyway? 
This is the vice president of the true student council. Huh. I brought him here to help me investigate the circumstances. This is merely a pretext, of course. The true student council? Yeah. Yes, it is an organization that was founded after the anomalies began. They have the Dean's approval. Hmm. This is Miki and Hidefumi. They are Subaru's classmates. This is pointless. It doesn't matter which student council he's from. Me and Yasunori are screwed either way. This is all part of Subaru's curse. The mist, the barrier, this crazy situation. All because we... It's all Subaru's fault! He's sick in the head, plain and simple. He's always reading these weird books about the occult and muttering spells in class. And then he started raving about how he'd curse the entire academy. That's when things started getting weird, like with the mist and the barrier. It was terrifying. After that, he started threatening everyone, claiming his power was the cause of it all. Hidefumi and his friends managed to lock Subaru in a classroom on the third floor, but... He jumped out the window! And killed himself! But the second he died, the mist started taking over our building, too! Subaru's spirit is possessing people to kill Hidefumi's friends, like you saw just now. Kokoro, Vice President! You have to save Hidefumi! Please! Okay. Well... Thanks. <laughs> Luckily for us, they believe his authority is some sort of curse. It'll be more convenient for us if they continue to do so. It saves us the time explaining. And about Hidefumi. What? Hmm. Never mind. The second floor is shrouded in mist. Let us head there and shatter Subaru's idea. No, no. When? Fine. Where is the no? The way, the way. Is there a friend of you? Oh my god. Okay, we'll see you guys on the next one night.